our Father, which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Let your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Give us our trespasses. We be those who trespass against us. Be not in no temptation, but live from all sin and evil. For thine are the kingdom, the power, and the glory. Father God, help you come this morning as humble as we know how. Think of a God who gives another golden opportunity to come out to pray and worship one more time. Father God, right now your hand and merciful little friendship this morning, Father God. Bless every home breath to him, my Father. Bless every family, Father. Touch them in a mighty way, Father God. Bless them what they need blessings, Father God. Bless our sick members, my Father. Bless our bereaved families in a mighty way, Father. Thank God let us see a new year, Father, that we've never seen before. Thank my Father for your blessing to take through all last year and right into the new year. Let things be as, as you would have it to be, Father. Let us wait with patience, Father God. Let us keep running this race to see what the end is going to be, my Father. Father, bless our sharing, in, Father God. Bless our, our members who don't know you right now to free our best sins. Touch them in a mighty way, Father God. Let us study your word, Father, so we be able to show them the way to go, the right way to go. Father, let us lay aside every way, Father God. Thank God for where you brought me to and where you take me from, Father. Bless our Lord and Deacon, bless our Mother Lord. Bless every member of this church congregation. Father God, bless and bless my family, Father. Touch them right now in a mighty way. Bless my daughter right now, Father. Keep her in your care, Father God. Touch my mother law Father, in a mighty way, Father. Thank you for my wife for blessing me in my family, my wife, Father. Thank you, God, for the first lady, Father God. Father, thank you for your word, because your word will set us free. Bless the choir this morning, God. Let us sing our best of our hearts to your glory, not to man's glory. Bless our virtues and our musicians, Father God. In the name of Jesus, we pray. Amen.
we thank God for you. And we thank God for leading the little friendship in this morning. Oh, we hope that you hear a word, a song, or maybe trying to pray that will engage the next week. Inspire you to come again. Thank you, thank you, and come again. The pastor has an announcement he's going to make concerning the all auxiliary. You want to get back to some of the things that we used to do, like first month clubs and auxiliary monthly report. He can explain it to you more better than I can. Amen. Let us continue to pray for those on our sickness. Pray for each other. You don't have to be sick, you need a prayer. And we all need prayer. If you pray, you pray, you pray, and I pray, I guarantee you something will happen. Amen? And uh, at this time, we turn to him, Lord, for you. Thank you very much. Darren, what did we just say about our service? I'd like to bless you that you all need to get together. A meeting the way you can start back being active. We're trying to ease our way back. I want you to encourage you to wear your mask out of sin and Alabama from that COVID. Some people have said it's real bad and they didn't last very long, a couple of days. They're going on. So just pray for the leaving family. Also, let us remember Sister Mary Walker. Her sister passed on yesterday and probably her last night. But let it be a prayer and pray for her. We can gradually go back if the Lord says so. We're not going to go down the fences. We're going to take our time. But I tell you, hey, let's get together. Give us a chance to the deacon board and instead of leaving the way we all can start being active. Okay. After the chairman, by Reverend Joseph Bain, the comment you're going to read out of church coverage. That was an announcement that I forgot. You know, people don't have to be nice. When they are nice, they don't have to be nice to you. There's a family that had thought enough of friendship. I think they gave some ties on of the Sunday, and today there's a bag of lady shoes that they has donated. They will be downstairs in the outreach room. They're all free. Just just go down and see what you want. And we thank God for this family, and we thank God for the gift.
say after after we carry the, the utensils and the wine and the leather bread back and make it become a table. I would like for the do the given today. I'm like a deacon singer. I'm gonna get back to start singing that again. And I want you to talk. Don't be afraid to talk. Fellowship going out. Shake somebody's hand. Keep your mask on. But shake somebody's hand. You don't know it may be the last time. Amen. Amen. Okay. Reverend Williams have already went through the ritual. Turn to utilize where everybody can participate. Jesus took bread and he broke it and he said, This is my body broken with you. Amen. Come on, let's do it together. And then after supper, he gave some and then he said, he told me about it, he said, this is my blood. This is the of a new testament, which is shed for many for the remission of sin. He told us that y'all drank all of it. Come on. And then not that on the scripture it said it's on a hymn and went out. But I want you to Get it, just go in and do it. I want Reverend Vikram to come down and he's going to read a scripture. And wherever he tells you to, you turn your Bible to Rise up from where you at in life. 
and tell yourself, I've been through some stuff. And I don't care how people smile in here, they've been through it too. But my best life is yet to come. Amen. The power, say amen, Jackson, the power of life is in the tongue. Do you want to get well? Or do you want to keep making excuses? John chapter 5, damn. Hey, Miss Savior. John chapter 5, baby. John chapter 5, it was a, a, a man. Sometimes your mind is crucified. Your mind is crucified. I don't know what somebody carried him. I don't know how he got there. But the Bible said that a certain man, you call his name, I guess that could have been anybody, laid at a pool for 38 years. Now God's life can put you through the change. Uh, 38 hours is a long time, but Thank you, thank you. Yeah. And, and, and at that time, you know, they had a concrete wall, and at a certain time of the year, a shadow would go down in the water, and they would say that God was trucked in the water. And whoever got in that water would be healed. I don't know what you're going through, but be healed. Come out of it. Don't let lies things and trials and tribulation wear you down and get you where you can't function. You can't even think right but your mind reminiscing itself. This man has been laid up so long one day Jesus came back. <laughs> the same Jesus they're talking about that in the world. Sister, sister, sister Mary Jesus comes by and says uh I uh, put this man that was laying at that pool down and said, Sir, mm -hmm. they come and say, Recognize <laughs> Sir, will thou. Amen. But if you got something on the inside of you saying, I'm from the beginning, you know what? If you think that in your mind, you want me. Man, what the happened and took they said, uh, Lord, every year, <laughs> when the, the angel come down and trouble the water, somebody always stepped down before me. Ain't that some kind of poetry? Yes. <laughs> you want to do something, you're going to let some nobody, no mind person, cause you to sit down on your Don't do 
that? They had to do it, but one day. One day. One day. Yeah. It's going to be payday. Do you hear what I'm saying? One day, we're going to have to stand before a just God. This man was walking alone and his name was Saul. He's on the last of the road. Yeah. Separate loved ones from each other. Yeah. Causing trouble in God's house. Yeah. And thought he was doing the will of the Almighty God. Yeah. How many know if you get too high? Yeah. Oh, talk back. Y'all, 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 y'all know God been good to you. You ain't got no right to sit down and act like that. How many know when you get too high? Yeah. God will. Thank you, down. The Bible says Saul was not good man. And I gotta tell y'all something. You know what? I, I, I know something today. God is in this house. Yeah. 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 You hear know what I'm saying? And you can talk to him personally. Yeah. Yeah. He got down. He said the first thing he said to him was, "Lord, who, who art thou?" Yeah. 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 Hey, Amen. We all know who God is. I'm the one. Well, you've been persecuting people in my name. Yeah. But God told him, go on down to where you stop. Yeah. And when you get down there, yeah. I hear y'all. Yeah. You're not a man by the name of the man now. How many of your prayer will show up word?
God in good. Mama, you can step over your phone and tell me that.